Okay, so we're at the start of the float process. This is the, uh, the batch plant where raw materials uh, arrive at site and then inside the building, the materials get weighed out to a very specific recipe and fed to the furnace. So the main material is sand. So it's literally just uh, sand that you'd find on a beach, although ours comes out of a quarry. Another really important raw material for us is, uh, is cullet, which is just broken glass. So that might be glass that's a result of our own process but particularly we bring back cullet from our customers. So very environmentally friendly. Glass is wonderfully recyclable. You can melt it time and time again. It doesn't gain anything, doesn't lose anything. And you can see that we've got quite considerable stocks. We've worked hard and currently bring back in order 5,000 tonnes a month. Basically the most interesting or the biggest part of the process is the furnace. We are melting the raw materials inside the furnace. You can get temperatures up to 1600 degrees. People working on the furnace, they have to be equipped uh, properly to resist that heat. When we melt the glass, you are not close to it. So if you look on a picture of, of a melted glass, it looks exactly like honey. So it's the same uh, physical aspect of it. So if you can imagine uh, very hot honey, it's going on top of molten tin. It's a bit like pouring a candle over the water. So we basically use gravity to make our glass very flat. So the gravity helps us to, to make the bottom part of the glass very flat and then we use special machines to form the glass. Uh, we go through a cooling process, so we'll go through uh, different stages of heating the, the glass into the lower temperatures, eventually through fan blowers where we can cool the, the glass down so it's not just an immediate cooling process. This is the cold then where we can set the orders. As you can see behind us we've got various cutting bridges which we can cut the, the glass to, to different sizes and different lengths eventually heading down towards the, the stacking area where we can eventually stack the glass and, and move it into the warehouse. 